Hey, I'm CNET's Ryan Christ here with the Cree Connected LED, our Editor's Choice winner in the Smart LED category. We first reviewed this bulb back in January and liked it quite a bit. It got an 8.5 out of 10. It worked with the Wink platform at launch and did quite a nice job on that platform. It would turn on and off when you came and went. It would turn on and off on a schedule. You could control it remotely from the app. All of that worked perfectly, but we didn't like that it worked just with Wink at launch. We wanted more official partners. Well, in the months since, we've seen those partners emerge. First up was SmartThings, which added official support for Cree LEDs last month. You can also control it on Staples Connect now with official support coming in the next month or two. And you can control it using the Philips Hue Bridge. So if you've got color-changing hue lights and you want a slightly less expensive option to add to your setup, these work well. When I say less expensive, that's exactly what I mean. These are $15 lights. That's about as cheap as smart lights get. In fact, that's exactly as cheap as smart lights get. Philips Hue Lux bulbs cost 30 a piece. Vulcan Wemo bulbs cost 30 a piece. This is one of the few options that's really come down to an accessible price point. It ties the GE Link LED at 15, but I think this one works a little better with the platforms that we've tested both on. Maybe a little laggier there on the Wink Hub, but you've got other options now, which is really important. The other options also bring in new features and functionality. For instance, the Philips Hue Bridge and the SmartThings Hub are both IFT compatible. They have IFT channels, so if you add the bulb to these hubs, you can control it using IFT. You can't do that with Wink. Beyond those connected features, this is a very good bulb. It draws 11.5 watts and puts out 815 lumens of light at 2700K. That's a nice yellowy color temperature. And when you turn it on, you can barely tell that it's not incandescent. It's got that same silhouette, and that's the Cree 4-Flow design at play. It's the bulb from last year, the dumb version of this bulb that Cree put out. It's the same design here with the Cree connected LED. I think it looks pretty good. Some people might not like that when the bulb's back off, it's got kind of a plasticky look. There's no glass. But all in all, I like this design. If you decide to go with a more expensive competitor like Philips Hue Lux or Belkin Wemos LEDs, you might notice a slight bump in color rendering capabilities, maybe a little bit better efficiency, but not enough of a jump to justify the price increase. Those cost twice as much per bulb as the Cree bulb. If you're outfitting a whole home's worth of lights, you're going to want something a little more affordable. The Cree bulb also does a better job connecting and automating with these platforms than the equally priced GE Link LED. All in all, that adds up to a pretty terrific value, the best option that we've seen in the smart lighting category yet, and that makes this bulb the winner of our editor's choice. Thanks for watching. Check out the rest of our reviews at CNET.com. For CNET Appliances, I'm Ryan Chris.